hi guys <laughs> welcome to another video i didn't know you guys are already there so this morning in nairobi kenya i am just hanging out with you guys and i hope every one of you guys is doing fine chameleon hello how are you good morning it's uh what time is it i don't have my clock with me now what is the time it's nine o'clock, okay? So right now, I'm just, you know, because electricity runs out very easily here in Kenya. And I have this solar, whatever, portable solar that needs to be charged. So I'm just preparing to take these ones to the sun. I have two, and guys, this was tucked away and it was it has been broken beyond recognition and i was not even informed this was any anyway, that is that is that is a housemates for you that is a bloody housemates might be asking these ones i bought them in the emirates they are quite good and they have they have like uh they are you're supposed to actually pin this one outside or in the roof and then the wires that have the what is it called that have the the bulb are very long so you're supposed to connect it from the roof this is supposed to stay outside then the wire is supposed to connect the other one in the oh my goodness this one is also broken anyway let me go and, and put them in the sun to get some energy i'll be back i'll be right back Hello everyone, welcome to Sunday Live Hangout. Nothing much is going on here, I'm just preparing my breakfast. And guys, let me show you guys the progress of my skin. This is up close and personal, not, um, Actually, I just woke up. This is up close and personal, no filter whatsoever. That is the skin. It's actually doing okay. I've seen people are like talking. They always be talking. Saying, ah, oh, wash your hands. Don't touch your face. Your dogs are what is causing you those acne, whatnot. 
Do, does these people not know that uh, acne is actually hormonal? Majority of hormonal? And it's not that I don't know what causes my, my acne. I do know. And it's, it's purely hormonal. It's not the first time that I'm having acne in my life. I always have acne. And they come and go, come and go. It's not a big deal for me. They usually come and go. I combat them. So actually, my sister, my sister very horrible um, acne and white heads. I think we got it from my from my mom because my mom also was uh, having such. So my sister, I think the Dubai weather is favoring her because. And apart from that, she got a very inexpensive, um, my God, guys, dogs are not easy to have. Dogs are so, so messy. God. Now I just give them bones and they decided to just mess up the entire place instead of, eh, I don't know. I don't know if I'm ready to have two dogs. I think I did not do my research before deciding to have two dogs. One was enough for me, man. One was enough. If anyone is in Nairobi and wants Kiki, please let me know. Take Kiki, please. <laughs> I want to give up Kiki. I've had enough. Two dogs were enough. Two dogs were enough. I didn't know that. Because you know the reason why I was having Kiki was so that she can mate and uh, I can have puppies. But Kiki has refused totally to mate. Uh, she's complaining and always yelling and always refusing totally. So I don't see the purpose. Plus is a is such a is, is a very high maintenance. She's a very high maintenance dog like I took, I took them for a walk the other day and she refused to walk she wants to be carried she doesn't want to walk instead of I don't know how to train to train her totally guys somebody was telling me to watch dog training I watched but then I'm, I'm just I tried and it didn't work and I'm like they can literally come from outside, especially Kiki, because guys, you know, Junior is a very, Junior is not, is not bad, because I've had Junior for the last four or five years or so, and I've always, Junior has always been sort of disciplined, to an extent, you put him to sleep at seven o'clock or like eight o'clock, eight, seven o'clock, you put him, I used to put him inside his room to sleep. He's with his beddings and everything. But then, then you wake up in the morning, you open for him. He doesn't pee in the room or poop in the room. Or his beddings was never wet. Just a clean, clean dog. But then now Kiki came. Now all of them have learned to now poop in the house, in the in the in where they sleep. They, they even uh, Pee on their on in their bowls, their food bowls, especially Kiki man. He'd be outside one minute and then the next minute, uh, the next minute he feel like one. She wants to pee. She gets straight back in the house and just pees in the house. That's what what they do. So super annoying. Junior was much more dear. But if you don't have an outdoor place, you cannot have Kiki. As in, if you don't have a balcony or like outdoor or like a garden, mm -mm, you cannot have her. Because she's going to create a havoc in your house like crazy. Um... So now I'm just 
always trying to create to to prepare myself to be very I wanted to cook uh, mandazis, but then I felt like I have videri in the fridge and I don't want them to get spoiled because my freezer is not properly functioning. So I said, let me, let me just remove them from the freezer before they get uh, spoiled. And I think today I'm going, I want to, I want us to later on to go and um, listen to some, some gospel Sunday music. I saw these two YouTubers rating African, African gospel artists. It was the best. I was so happy. The one that seemed to have won was this Nigerian one. Also South African one were doing so well. They are American, but then they were just like, there is very much great talent in Africa, especially in Nigeria and South Africa, when it comes to vocals. Forget Kenya. Kenya, I haven't seen. I haven't seen super super um, super musicians, as in the ones who really have great vocals. Mm -mm. Great vocals, idol worthy great vocals. That's what I mean. Like you know, the voice. There is this thing that has been on news that young girls. There's these boys that I don't know where they got. I don't know, like, it's very strange. Six girls got, went missing. Six teenagers went missing. And they are all friends. They just went missing. And what happened is they don't have a phone, but their dad, one of them, their dad was sleeping. So they gave their dad's number so that their abductors can call through their numbers. So they were, they were found from the social media. Their abductors hooked up with them through via Instagram and promised them uh, some modeling auditions, what not, and called them for a modeling, say to them, and they had a, a number that is is a foreign number. It's not it's not an African number. It's like a number that belongs to some foreign number like plus one dash seven dash what what what. This is the number. This girl goes missing for one week flat. So their parents are obviously, they are not communicating. Their parents are going crazy, on, going online and, and, you know, talking and crying and yada, yada, whatnot. But these girls have been abducted and they are in some, in some house. They are just OG, doing OG and whatnot with these men. They are 16. They are still teenagers. They are supposed to be in school, but obviously because of COVID, schools are not functioning. So it's quite really that, like really strange. That is why I don't blame people who who lock their teenagers in the house totally, because some of these girls are are really sneaky. The minute you think that your child doesn't have a phone, hmm, or your child doesn't have a way to get online, because their parents were like, oh, they don't have a phone, la la la, what not. This girl took her dad's phone when the dad was sleeping. And um, 
and made sure that that the person contacted her through her dad's phone. They packed their clothes and left. Meanwhile, they are having fun. They are like they are engaging in in adult adult activities. And their parents are crying like crazy. Six or seven girls. So now they are being being investigated, and they were they were found, and they were taken to the they are in the police custody, whatnot. They are being taken to the hospital for examination. I think they are they supposed to be examining them to find out if they've been doing the deed. But of course, what do they expect? Of course, that's what they've been doing all along. When I was a teenager, there was no way I could even imagine myself behaving like that. After I, I found my first, my first uh, menstrual, I could not. And they were saying, oh, the guy who abducted, abducted them was a Caucasian man. Yada, 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 yada only to come back and find out that it's just because these people will lie to them that they're from I don't know America or where only to come back and realize that actually those are I don't know where people find this these numbers UK numbers because guys remember there is a lot of scam people who use UK numbers they use UK, US numbers. They are all over the place. There's a guy who was trying to scam me and he was using a UK number here. He is a Kenyan. Hmm? UK number. Some time back. Somebody was asking me next time I'm cooking, I should ask, I should ask people, I should actually write on my, on my community page and say what I'm cooking so that everyone can, can join and cook the same thing <laughs> and eat together. I need to wash this thing separately because I can see, I can see the thingy. This person has some... I think I'm just going to cook a bit and leave the rest. It's too much for me to eat all at once. 
Okay. to finding love and dating and whatnot. They want to know, they want to find out if, if do we, are we loved elsewhere? Are we appreciated out, out here? Like, they like, I don't know, man. I think they feel like, oh, well, we are, we are, we are being loved by other people, not just, you know, People find us attractive, people find us good looking, people, people adore us, you know? So they always feel like they are very mesmerized. When they are in the presence of, of other ethnic, ethnic group, ethnicity, ethnic men, I don't know what it is. But they flock those videos, they flock those channels like crazy. And some of them were, were coming to my video when I was uh, reacting to, um, to the, you know, to the, the, the Rachel Otieno uh, whatever video. They were coming, of course, these are ladies who feel like their hopes are getting dashed. When it comes to meeting people out there, because they really think that it always works with this man. They really think that all, all white men love African women, especially the, 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 the dark, tall ones, slender. 
They always think that all of them, the majority of white men would die for such, such women. But the truth is, majority of white men marry within their own, their own ethnicity. They produce within their own ethnicity. If they are looking for, in, my, in most cases, if they are looking for a, a black woman, woman, they are just looking for one so that, you know, in most cases, I don't say, I didn't say always, they are looking for the thrill and for fun and to, to count, body count, to brag to their friends that they've already uh, been with a black man, a black man, a woman, to find out how black women are. That's all it is. But some of we were here beating, abusing me for speaking such truth. And the brainwash, shedding light on the brainwash that is going on amongst us. You need to work with these people and you need to actually sit down and work with them, interact with them, to find out how they truly, truly reason out. How they truly, truly think. Then you will make up your mind. All the brainwash that you've been having and all the assumptions that you've been having will fade away. Totally. So, The ladies who are watching the, such videos and having their hopes high and talking like, you know, classy, princessy, go-getter, hard-working, I'm like, okay. That's a go-getter. That's a role model. That's goals. That's what they call role model, go getter, and goals. <clears throat> then a lady would come to my channel only to have an abuse and run away. Because they feel like it's not even supposed to be talked about when it goes wrong. Interracial relationship went wrong. So why are you even talking about it? Why are you bringing down fellow African women? Why, why are you bringing, bringing down your fellow African woman? In that video, what I was doing was sharing experiences and talking about my experience and also relating to her, to her, and reacting to her video. But any book, The relationship goals that you guys are banking on here on social media are very questionable. You better bank on your parents' relationship, your father and your mother's relationship, and leave these other relationships alone. They are all but just for a show and absolutely acting. Ask yourself the reason why they never come and tell you guys exactly what happened what happened, when, what went wrong, so that you, the people who, who, actually, who actually would learn from their experience would learn. Why can they come and, to, and talk about it, rather than just be crying? I'm 
amazing. Yeah, they don't. They be bringing all this and creating an illusion, and people shipping women, be following and and putting their hopes high over these fake relationship relationships on social media. These people are never honest. They are never honest. And when it breaks out, the relationship breaks up, it's always a man's fault. I don't believe it. That is always a, ma a, ma a man's fault. Women do not always own to their part of whatever they, the role they play to make whatever didn't work, didn't work. They always shame a man. For example, this man that shall not be named, he, he obviously said, because I don't think that he has a reason to lie or anything, which if you see from the, from the, the channel itself, the channel was started in 2011, when they were not even together to start with. And the guy was making his own videos, was making, you know, different types of video, whatnot. And then when they got together, the lady probably promoted to him the interracial relationship agenda. Because guys, it's very true. As African women, we always want to, to film to publicize this kind of things. Let it be known that I'm out here being loved by a white man, okay? Let it be known. Majority of time it's their idea, the lady's idea. Then, this guy played along with it. They painted a picture of how, God, I don't know how I feel about the, the entire situation. Only for it to always have not been working out, then the lady if the lady herself, she saw, she, she moved on, made her own platform, which has great following, if I can say that so myself, great subscription, viewers are watching because they like being sold that type of lifestyle. That's that they like. They like lifestyle of the glammed up lifestyle that they have no idea how it's getting funded. Where am I getting my money? How is it getting funded? But it's glam. It doesn't matter where she's getting her money. She's a go-getter. When she chose to make videos and, you know, introduce the new men and the new whatnot and the chopper and all the helicopters, what are they called? These choppers and, and aeroplanes. Did this man wake up from her, his house to come and be salty over this kind of behavior? No, because he moved on with his life. So what is the reason why, if this guy also decided to move on with his life and, and delete the, the previous videos to make videos with this other woman, 
Why is someone being salty now? What is the problem? He so stole subscribers. What subscribers did he steal? These subscribers who had been subscribed to that channel are humans who have oblangata and they are very smart. They can, if they don't like him, they can easily just move on. And subscribe and move on and follow their princess, their African tiara princess. And leave this man alone. What was the reason of this shipley women deciding to go and bully this man on his comment session? It is very clear that he is a white man that you are cursing around with and lying around with and, and having all the cursy video moments with. Then the, the minute it didn't, and you are very comfortable with him, the minute it didn't work, now all of a sudden he's a racist. So you are lying, uh, lying down with a racist. You are lying down with somebody who actually call you an end. Well, is that what you are doing? Ah! It is very clear that this man could easily, easily be a, a very badly target of women running to his channel to go and do what? And bash him. This man, I am not, I'm not even taking sides. But based on the, his statement and whatever he said, it is very clear that this man is acted very mature. He acted very mature. He did not blast this woman. He did not say anything negative about this woman. He covered her so much. The only part in the video that this woman went salty about was the fact that he said everything is real. The guy just mentioned everything is real. Without even saying this girl's name or what not, what is real. So the guy, they, they said, these girls were like, oh, you're throwing shade. You're throwing shade that she's not real. Well, she wasn't. She's not. Why are you throwing shade over her and saying that things are not real, things are real with this one? Gosh. And the guy did not even mention this girl's name. Guys, this talk is to tell you how much of shipley we can be, some of us African women. Very gullible and shipley. Because why exactly would you send a, a, a swarm of bee to somebody that, that you claim that you loved? These women went on the comment station and were said, gosh, guys, if you want to see the level of pettiness and the level of, of, of disgrace, being desperate amongst African women, uh, African um, uh, relationship, international relationship hopefuls, go and read the comment section of that video. Go and read. You will see how those ladies are very trifling. How dare. She made you look very good. She made you look handsome. Now you look like Hitler. You look pathetic. God. <laughs> Can people be left and just be, be and just move on with their life? Can you just break up and move on with your life? Because to be honest, if people are not truthful and people are not saying exactly what people are supposed to be, you know, be told. You're not telling people well. 
Yes, the subscriptions. She claimed that you use my subscription and you stole the talent from me. Well, guys, both of you are making videos together. You are shining, as they supposedly say, next to a white man. He was also an actor in your play. And because of him being involved with you in this project, you attracted these interracial relationship hopefuls to come and flock your channel. The agenda was promoting the interracial relationship and he was, he was, the white man was the main actor in this play. Remember? Not the black woman. So after the, the play went and went, of course they gained subscriptions and people came and people laughed and whatnot and whatnot. And the, the things went sour. Of course, and the only many time that you would blame this man, because the channel was initially his, the only time that you will blame him for stealing your channel, your, your idea and your content was if he had your, your videos with him up. Otherwise, things to do with subscriptions, subscribers can always pack and, and, you know, and leave and go and follow you and stop following this man. Stop kicking knife. Can follow can easily go and follow this man and stop following you. Stop following him and come and follow you. And it's very clear that the guy was never ever. It was very clear that the guy was never ever going to make any money anymore with his channel. So, the ladies who are coming to my channel to abuse me for my commentary or, or say this and that, I think that you guys are, are just not ready to listen to the truth behind all this. Because listen, I had this mindset, I know this type of mindset that us African women have. I know it. And there is no point of you deciding to, to side with one person, you having not been in, been in that relationship yourself, there is no point of you running to the guy's page and abusing him and sending him hate and bullying him. There is really no point. If you guys are princesses, have your tiaras, carry it on your heads and stop, stop being, getting so low to the point where you went so low. You went and started uh, bullying. For what? For what are you bullying? Every one of their channels now. She have a channel, he have her channel. She's making her content, she's having a, the time of her life, she's happy, the other one is happy. Stop it! Kiki, There's no point. You're jealous, you're jealous of her, you're jealous, you're jealous, jealous of her. What am I jealous of? Tell me exactly what am I jealous of? If it is traveling, I have traveled. If it is uh, planes, I have climbed them. If it is uh, I have sofa, I have climbed them. If it is a uh, passion, I have a mansion. 
If it is a swimming pool, I have swimming pool. If it is a, a, a swimming costume, I have swimming costume. If it is makeup and wig, I have makeup and wig. What is it that I am jealous of? What is it that I'm jealous of? If it is abroad, I have gone beyond. What is it that I'm jealous of? Tell me. Just listen, sometimes the truth hurts, I know. But people doesn't always have to be jealous of people to, to, to give their, their opinion or even to, to, to have commentary regarding or to react to a video. It's not always about jealousy. Okay? So that jealous um, card that you're bringing on my video and playing on my video, I've heard it enough. I've heard it so many times that it doesn't even bother me anymore. Hmm. Hmm. Salt. I don't think I'm going to put her. Um, <laughs> Let me read what you guys are saying. Guys. Ha! Guys, I feel like my skin is crawling. When someone is saying that you are jealous of so and so, what is there to be jealous about? What is it, guys? What is there to be jealous about? Even me, anybody can actually act a lifestyle. Anybody can act. So don't come here and tell me that I'm jealous. I'm not jealous of anything. It's very shame. Guys, it's very, it's an absolutely shame how low us African women can go. If you want to know, go to the comment section of that particular video that I'm talking about. Especially the guy's video. And then read the guy, how the guys, the ladies were bullying. Were bullying this guy. He can only be a human being and he can only be attractive if he is besides besides her or what because everything was just in your mind it's your illusion it was a thrill of the moment it ended he's now gone to 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 be with his own what is the problem find your own as well his own kind Everybody have a type. You can think you are princess, you can think you look like this, you can think la 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 la. But if you are not somebody's type, you're not somebody's type, you cannot force it. No matter how much you want to force it, you cannot force it. Not all white men will marry a black woman. Yes, they will sleep with them. Of course, they will. But not marry them. Not all. I said it. Come, call police. I said it as somebody who's also ever been in an, in an, in an interracial relationship. Did I marry? Did he marry me? No, he did not. Now, who you, I'm talking the truth. inside my sugar walls? No, he did not. I just want to make that clear. Mm, he did not get inside my sugar walls. Hey, hey. these sugar walls did not make some it was not a samba 
the sugar was was closed. Do you can't eat from what? Guys, my gravy. I'm not jealous. I am not hitting. I'm not judging. But I am judging. Call for this. Nilifunga duka lakini pesa yo. Yes guys, you know what? Some of these men would do anything. Especially this Caucasian man. They'll do anything to get inside your surwa. Anything. So this guy, the one that I was with, huh? Huh? He even climbed my roof. Not this house, somewhere else. He was actually putting roof on top of my house. He just wanted it so bad because he was asking himself, why is it that this girl don't just sleep with me? Why? Why can't he, why can't this? Stop it! Why can't he? Because you, you know the guy was so used to, to ladies, uh, African ladies just doing it. To an extent, he did not understand why. So he really, really tried, guys. But those days, I was looking for a husband. I was not looking for body counts. I was looking for, and I was very strict about that. I was still in the in the mind of you know sex outside marriage is seen and la la la. So I put in, I, I kept, I kept, I put in pending. I put in pending. But the level of this guy's generosity was out of this world. I will never forget, there was a day he went to the ATM here in Kenya when he came to visit and he just like withdrew one million Kenya shillings from the ATM and he said, he said this one million, you can do whatever you want with it. This one million here, you can do whatever you want with it. He was so generous, but guys, he was—he's not a—he was—he's not a husband material because um, he really didn't want to get married. He never want to have children. He's been divorced before, and he complained that. His divorce cost him a lot of money and he never wanted to go through that again. At first he was like, he was like, I might actually get married. Let's see. So he was just testing the waters. It is all of a sudden so hot and I want to have it. God, I am sweating like a pig. I need to go up and freshen. I need to go up and then freshen and then I'll come back to you guys. I don't know how. No, you guys are not coming. I'm sorry, you're not coming with me upstairs. I'm just gonna come freshen, put some lawn. I'm sweating and then come back.
<laughs> sorry, sorry, guys. <laughs> I went to, to tend wear some a t-shirt at least. I look a bit, a bit, uh, as in smell nice now. So. Hey guys, why are you not why are you not liking my my videos? Ah. Why are you guys not liking the videos? <laughs> I thank God for my for my skin, man. It's getting so much better. My skin is getting a lot much better. But it's because... Actually, it's because of the cream that my friend got me from Canada. Sent me from Canada. Let me see. What am I eating? I'm eating githeri. I'm eating githeri. Got to say that she has impeccable test. Impeccable. Who is who has impeccable test? Hmm. Betty Mwangi is saying, I used to love being in relationship. I don't get a little peek into the pink, pink punch of roses. Oh, let me try read from the front, from them. Hello, Ruby, what are you preparing for breakfast, Gideri? Mm. Good morning, Ruby. Mm-hmm. Someone is saying Ali for, for Ali pro breakfast, they are in Florida. Yes, I was cooking. I love cooking. And this Gideri, guys, you should actually test it. It is unbelievably nice. All ingredients, all organic. Organic, organic. <clears throat> Someone is saying... Hmm... Someone is saying they find swirling kind of strange themselves. I don't think it's strange. If you find one who loves you, it's just like any other relationship, to be honest. The problem is finding a genuine one who really loves you. Peace and love is saying I'm jealous of her. I don't think so, but it's okay. It's, it's your opinion, so let it stand. Someone is saying she's not jealous, she's just stating facts. Facts is jealousy to the, to the interracial relationship hopefuls. They don't want to listen to facts. <laughs> 
someone has a name here on this channel, husband material. And he's a white man who's looking for a, a black woman, a black woman. You can you can mingle on the comment section on the on the super chat. There are ladies there. Mingle. Husband Matilio, thank you for watching my channel. Chameleon, we are jealous, my friend. We are jealous of how, um, gosh, I don't think so. I'm not, I don't think I'm jealous, honestly. Been there, done that, got a t-shirt from it. Now all I want to do is sit with no makeup and eat my gizeri on the camera. And I'm not even bothered. Sit with a kitambara on my head, eat my gizeri with no makeup. So peace and love, I say, <laughs> I'm jealous of her life. Oh, God. No, please. I think you, you really admire your, her life. Imagine there are people who, who don't really, don't really, don't really get, get sold such, such things of camera and, and whatnot and the YouTube. We've seen glam YouTube, YouTubers, okay? If that's what you call glam, you are very low. We've seen glam. Some Agnes Agi is saying marriage is how one takes herself. If you show yourself your sex object, then you shall be taken that way. Exactly. Marriage or even relationships. The way you conduct yourself is how people take you. The way you market yourself. Even socialites. Are very expensive out here. Are you guys following Huda the boss chick? If there is anybody glamorous on this social media, it's Huda. She leaves people guessing. Who is she dating? Who is she with? Who is she screwing? Who is she? Blah, blah, blah. Who is she? That is Huda, the boss chick. And she don't give up. She's not my role model. I'm just talking about the glam. Mm. My one eyebrows is so filled up. That one is empty. Guys. If I say that I just want to be glam for a whole one month, wigs and wigs and makeup, because you know I can you I can look bomb, 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 digging bomb, bomb dot com, with all these things also. If I put my chest to it, and nobody in this social media is gonna say, oh. Look, so and so is much more beautiful. 
You gon' see. If I put my chest into putting makeup, you want to compare me now? Honey, the eyes, the cheekbones, the lips, the nose, you will be confused. Is this impress or not? <laughs> Let me hype myself before you guys come for me now. Uh -uh. If I choose to, hmm, hmm, you would not recognize me. But I, want, I don't want to slap you guys with that. Mm. Let me read. Oh my God, why is it? <clears throat> Someone is husband material is saying I'm such a character. What does sugar wall mean? Man, how can you don't know what sugar wall mean? Sugar walls, if you don't know, Google. Google is your friend. Sugar walls is the goodie. The goodies. Where children come from. Somebody wanted to go upstairs. <laughs> what? Guys, I enjoyed this Gideril too much. Husband material, you, beca you are becoming a bit strange now. <laughs> Somebody, you did get a little peekaboo. Where? Hmm. I need to add myself some, some Gideri man. Divambi, <laughs> Divambi, you gave me super chat again. Oh my God. Thank you so much, Divambi. Divambi is the most loyal, loyal, loyal um, watcher ever. She's always, always blessing me in the morning, man. Thank you. <laughs> I'm afraid. But I'm happy. Oh my god. Guys, <clears throat> I know that you guys are wondering. 
I'm eating too much, right? Last night I did not eat. So this is my first meal of the day. And this in the evening, I'm just gonna have fruits. So this is this is it. I'm not gonna cook again. I only cook and eat once. And last night also I didn't eat, so it's okay. Don't worry, don't worry. And plus, it's not anything that is making me fat. It's just normal food. Sunday, boxing, talk. Mm. Mm -hmm. Impress your beautiful babe with or without makeup. We have seen you in both. Kikngato Hedreni. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much. Someone is telling me that to compare me with, with some with another YouTuber here on YouTube, I must be jealous because she's beautiful and all that and all that. I'm like, okay. I'm not, okay, no problem. No problem. Let us shine. We are not competing. Someone is saying Huda and other socialites are the most miserable people in the world if they can be honest. Probably, you never know. Ru uh, Paul Graves is saying, Ruby, good morning. Habari from New York. R Graves, when is your wedding? I remember you're getting married. When is your wedding? Or is it co this uh, COVID has, all, has made everything stop for you guys? Graves, Graves is engaged to a Kenyan woman. Guys. I hear that American men are coming to Africa for African women. They want to marry African women. And they are tired with their fellow American, African American women. Is it true, Graves? Is it true? <laughs> are we are we wife material? Are we more wife material than African American women? Huh? I want to know. Guys, welcome to my mukbang show. I cook and eat and talk rubbish. Mm -hmm. Someone is saying they're just here from Empress. Someone is saying, try and we see, show us your best self. Oh, I will show you. But forget, I hate wigs, okay? I don't wear those stupid things on my head. They smell like goat's ass. If you want to see me with makeup, keep watching. But right now, <clears throat> Right now, because my face is healing, make up candle. What do I need to prove to this woman who is telling me to put on makeup so that I can uh, she can compare me? How about go bare face the entire time so you can compare people the way they are? Be you. I don't have to put on make put put on makeup because you are telling me to put on makeup. So forget it. Mm. Someone is saying a, a bit talkative. Hey, husband, why? It's, it's very funny. I am not talkative. I'm the most quiet person you will ever find. I only talk because the camera is on. Because right now, 
if this camera, what will happen if I don't talk and the camera, the, the live is on? I think I'm going to, I'm going to change the title of this video. Guys, can you tell me what I can title this video? I'm now full. Guys, what are you guys laughing at? The, the wig. I hate those things with a passion. Honestly, hmm. I'd rather cut my hair. Chit chat and chow. No. You have to make it something controversial. No. I know what I will put. But that one is going to be so controversial that guys are going to come for me. Interracial relationship hopefuls will come for me. Thank you so much for the super chat. Divambi, I'm jealous of fellow YouTuber. Oh, yes! Oh, Divambi! Good, 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 good. <laughs> I'm going to put that. Oh, yes, yes, controversial. I'm so jealous, it's unbelievable. Thank you, Jesus, for that good meal. Tea is very spicy. It has a kick to it. Let's, I think, I don't know if, if I put on, oh, let me see. My, I think my, my electricity is going to run off when I am talking because I didn't, I didn't put money in my token. See? You see this blinking thingy? It's, it's at 14. I still have quite some. But the minute it starts blinking, and you see the sad face inside blinking, that means I need to, I need to load it. I need to get my phone and load it. Because I want to, I want to also react, react to some gospel music from, from, from this, this television. I also, hold on. Today we are hanging out, guys, and it's gonna be a live hangout. Maybe it's gonna be long, long live hangout. And I'm going to, 
I'm going to blur out. Yeah, I'm going to blur out that. You see the reflection on the TV? I want to put something to blur it out. How is it? It's still, <laughs> it's still reflecting. Let me see. No. It will fall. Guys, I'm going to bring my phone and then bring this. I'm thinking this. Was, is this going to really help? Guys, you see the you see the windows? How it's it's really gonna the way it is. I can't have it like this when I want to react to anything on TV. Let me leave that for now. Let's see. Hmm. It's still, it's still, f oh God. It's just a small bit. Oh, let me get another one. Another group. Feel like it's still reflecting. What? There is no way I can do the entire window. the entire window what the hell it's 
very annoying. Guys, that is the least I could do. <coughs> it's not working. This is not working. We are gonna listen to this. Fast and affordable rides at the tap of a button. Fault, the smartest way to move. I hate when they put when they put um Reflecting. 
You've done so much for me I cannot tell it all
staying in me. I am DJ today. my ass off can you tell me guys which music you want me to play for you guys i'm sweating oh. which music which music you guys want me to play wait let me see i want a good very good uh, worship music as in praise uh, which one is this this is uh, I don't know what is which one is this. I've never listened to it. Oh, this one I like. They are going to monetize this video. Guys, I'm sure they will demonetize this video. So thank you, Divambi, for the super chat. Already this video has made $11, so it doesn't really matter. If they...
listening to music today is sunday live so i'm playing for you guys uh, this is a nice song but i have okay i will play mighty god by joe Perez. so wait a gospel choir i'll do that Yeah, 
play is your song guys if you want your music played uh, if you want me to play so yes for this song enough so I'm gonna play another one I'm gonna
Jerusalem. Guys, if, if you want your music played, you have to tell me. to go and ready to my weekend zoom class see you zoom, uh, uh, thank you so much divami may god bless you abundantly dorothy thank you so much for the super chat thank you so 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 much i need to find another song so that guys if you are not um you're not uh, suggesting a song i need to to find you guys Wow, I have really, really danced today. I need to find a music, but I can't. I don't know why I cannot find any more music. 
especially African music. Buna boy, they know I am. <laughs> Oof. Can you guys suggest a, meme, a song that you want me to play? A song that you want me to play? Derepi Ubiam. Thank you so much for the super chat. Which song do you guys want me to play? Uh, let me just go. All right. Oh my goodness, I have sweated like crazy. African. I know this music is going, this, uh, today's channel, today's video is going to be super chat, to be demonetized. But I thank you guys so much for, for the super chat. So at least, it's not going to be in vain that I've made this video today. Thank you so much. I can't find any... Where is it? Where should I go? Back home. There is only like uh, the music that is coming here now is like uh, circular music. But today is Sunday and we only want to Oh, let me let me play this one. Today is Sunday, and we only want to praise. This boy, I think this boy is is very good at. Gosh, I'm sweated like this. Mm -hmm. one and then uh, this 
Guys, the, for those who are just joining. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. He was in the beginning with God. All things were made through Him, and without Him, nothing was made that was made.
the best 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 gospel musicians or the best artists are coming from nigeria and south africa like there is just no no actually um question about that we are we can agree to disagree but those those two oh, guys i need to i need to go and take a shower i've really sweated and thank you so much for those of you who have who have been um uh, who have actually um, sort of made this live uh, what it is now. So thank you so much. I wanted to say who have actually reacted to the live or what word? Why is my English disappearing now? Um, interacted in the live. Yeah, that's what I wanted to say. So anyway, guys, have a lovely day. I think I'm going to end this. Actually, I'm, I'm ending it here. Thank you so much, Divambi. Thank you so much, Dorothy Abiyam. Thank you guys for your super chat. May God bless you abundantly. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Have a lovely day. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.